Bye. <laughs> Rob and Amelia are leaving. The rest has also already left. Um, and yeah, I guess we can start our vlog for today. Welcome to the Sky Limit Events Track Day. I didn't get to film with those guys because it's just about lots of running around and etc. etc. I'm trying to get a lap in the Rentec uh, GTR, 825 horsepower if I'm correct. I think it's going to be pretty special because I already had a lap in the M4, you know, the other cars. And I think the GTR is something that you guys want to see how it looks like. Bye! In the meanwhile, we can have a look what's happening on the track. Uh, what kind of cars do we have here? Traditionally wise, lots of Porsches, lots of BMWs. But there we have something special as well. We have Challenge 458 cars. Uh, there was also a GT3 car. Uh, there is an R8 over there. Um, nice M3. But then, oh yeah, you can hear the cars going fast because the main straight is open. I'm not sure, I don't think this is the car from, is that, the, no, that's not the street legal car uh, that we see here quite often at the ring. But it's something else. Oh, and there's the GTR. So maybe we can just like hop in and go for a lap. <laughs> yeah, he's getting Red Bull before we go for a lap. Pardon? Are we going for a lap? Later? I don't know. Um, like one hour to go. I just refueled. Little break. You want a break? No, I, I'm just doing this break. And then we go. Yeah. Okay. But not too long because the time pressure is getting low. So. Okay, so I'm uh, getting my helmet and we jump. Yeah. Good. Let's go.
right flow today, but yeah, better than nothing. At least some fun. <laughs> I hope that uh, other people could say that this is not being in the right flow. So, can you tell us a bit more about the car, actually? This car has nearly the same setup like our um, record car. That's 760 horsepower. Mm -hmm. uh, brake upgrade, brake cooling. Well, no, actually, this one is on ceramics and the uh, record car is on steel brakes. So this car has stock ceramic discs, but upgraded brake pads uh, with a special compound made for us. Um, obviously, better brake cooling, steel braided hoses, better brake fluid than the tune, big turbos, exhaust. So 760, you said? Yeah. But you could also do 825, but that's a bit too much well, for the track then. Even yeah, more. even more. Yeah, well, there is like an export version with nearly uh, 900 available. Okay. Shortly, oh, cool. Actually. That's very nice. I really much enjoyed it. I hope you could see it also that the car, although it has lots of power, we were definitely the fastest car out there. Uh, nothing overtook us. We overtook everything else as if we were standing still. It's very fast, but it's very controllable, which is actually quite exceptional because you have a gazillion horsepower, but to make it actually work on the track is definitely something else. And that's what distinguishes Rentec from uh, many others because you actually, I haven't seen a single day that you've been not lapping because you're pretty much every single day testing the cars, right? Yeah, well, when the day allows, you know, yeah, yeah, of can't course. go out every day, but yeah, but, uh, uh, but quite as, often. as often as, as possible, for sure. Cool. Well, thanks again, one more time, and well. see you next time in, you have anything special incoming for next year? For next year, for sure, yeah. But not allowed to say yet. Well, no, we have the uh, GT63, the four-door coupe coming. Okay, that would be interesting. Hopefully this year, because uh, apparently this car is, again, much better than the new E-Class, which is already quite fast you can yeah. even use it on the track um, and well maybe not as a track car mm -hmm. to make at least uh, a couple of, of fun laps and or maybe a, even as a taxi or something like that um, and apparently the GT is even better okay although it's basically the same drivetrain and everything uh, there's a G63 coming but I don't know when because there are huge delays with these cars at the mm -hmm. moment for whatever reason and yeah let's see let's see awesome well Stay tuned, follow them, follow me, then we go for a lap and uh, let's check out what else we have here on the track. Again, one more time, thank you, enjoy the rest of the day and see you next time. Yeah, that was pretty exciting, pretty awesome. Let's check out the rest of the grids that we have here today. Like I said, there is a second challenge that's, I think it's a GT3 car actually. It's, uh, it's definitely beautiful enough to pose for it. Um, yeah, fancy, beautiful, amazing, 458, last natural aspirated GT car. GT like GT3 car and uh, like like turbocharged 488. Uh, let's see what else we have on the small car park. It's a nice Clio Cup car. Uh, lots of lots of other cars. I'm pretty sure behind this massive tent there's also lots of other cars. But most importantly, give a huge shout out to the people who made Sky Limit events 2018 and 19 and 20 possible. So thank you very very much. Welcome. Thank you thank you very much. Thank you very very much. And thank you, and everyone else who is not present here. What are the plans for next year? First, we celebrate New Year. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, we're planning to do like uh, again, like three, four, five track days here. Okay, just five. whatever Nevercreen gives you. In yeah, I requested like five days or six days, and uh, so in the end, we will end up with three or four, like as usual. Yeah. Uh, we will do uh, again like six, seven days in Spa. Mm -hmm. About 20 days in Zolder, I guess. The Nürburgring Drift Cup, uh, or Drift School in Zolder. So uh, yeah, maybe I'll come for that in the winter. Yeah, you like should last do year. Should yeah, do definitely. It. And uh, so it will be another busy year, I think. Awesome. And uh, I ordered this weather for every event. That's so, good. So, uh, but so Deutsche Post is sometimes like being Deutsche Post, and then you get something yeah, else. That's right. That's right. So but, we'll uh, see. Yeah. Maybe I should pray more. <laughs> <laughs> cool, thank you very much. If you want to join them, those are the rough prices. Obviously, if you in Zolder, it's a lot less, but it's yeah. also sometimes uh, less. And just check out their website and uh, yeah, join us on Scandinavian Advanced Track Day. Thank you very much one more time. See you guys next year. Bye. Well, and you probably want to know how this went down. I think it's something for the video of tomorrow. Having fun? That was actually gonna be a pretty good lap. That's good. Then we got a red then we got a red flag. <laughs>